I've created a falling sand game, basically a sand particle simulator. Uh, here it is on screen. We have different types of particles here, and this entire screen is basically implemented as a cellular automata that updates based on its current state from frame to frame at 60 hertz on the VGA screen. This here is supposed to be sand, water, salt, and oil. They don't always properly mimic, you know, the, the actual behavior in real life. They all actually behave very similarly to one another. I have down here a keyboard which I can use to select the particle type to draw to the screen and then move the on-screen purple cursor with these arrow keys here and press the draw button. So I'm going to go ahead and draw a few walls right here. And you can see that the sand starts to form a pile. Uh, similarly, you can start drawing here to split the water. Now I can show you a bit about how these particles interact with each other. Uh, so, for example, if I take the salt and the water here, they will mix together. The water will mix with the salt to make it wet, make salt water. Uh, sand is insoluble in water. It will sink to the bottom. Now similarly, if I form a nice pool of oil here and try to drop some water into it, the oil rises to the top of the water. On the other hand, if I draw a wall to connect the salt and the oil, there's really no preference for one over the other. They don't sink into one another, they just kind of form their own piles. The same thing would be true of, for example, sand and salt together.